So welcome back to the, the Cooperage here at Tomato Distillery. Today we're going to look at these big casks, uh, port pipes, all the way from the Dura Valley in Portugal. These casks themselves are 40, 50, 60 years old, uh, but for the last 20 years they have been actually holding a tawny port. That's a port that uh, is more sort of brown, russet brown, golden brown in colour, because it's been allowed to oxidise in these casks for so long. That then imparts quite a, a nice character into our whisky, because uh, it gives you this lovely sort of nutty type expressions to add to the already complex tomato house style. So what we'll do with our whisky, for instance with the 14 year old here, is actually mature it as normal in hogsheads, refill hogsheads, for the first 13 years or so. And then for over a year it will sit in these tawny port pipes. And that will bring out the character from the previous contents rather than the wood. These casks are very, very big, they're about 620 litres, so the contact with the wood is quite small for the spirit. Um, the wood also being quite old means that there's not a lot of extractives left, so instead of getting wood driven characters, we get lots and lots of characters coming from the port, which has been absorbed into the oak, and then we draw that back out with our whiskey, which complements our flavours as we say. It means that with a 14 year old new core expression, um, we get all the house style, the fruity character coming through, but that's complemented by the lovely nutty character, sort of walnut and pecan type style that comes through there, uh, and the colour as well. Normally with a port wood finish, you would expect it to be slightly reddish in colour, but by using these tawny port casks, it means we get a lovely golden brown colour. As an extension as well, not only is there a 14 year old port wood finish, but we also have a 1988 vintage coming out which isn't exclusively finished in these, but a part of it is. So again, you get that wonderful complement of the nutty flavours coming through. So I hope you'll enjoy them, whether it be the 14 or the 1988, because they are really, really nice whiskies, I have to say.